Do you see the color on this, bro? This that this that good drink, my. Look, look. Y'all get the good pours in it. Got two cups. There is you. I know you. So you see, I wouldn't follow. What do you mean you know me? I do know you like that. You gotta get good content. <laughs> I gotta get good content. You can put alcohol in my drink for, for content. You, my for content. For content. For you, my nigga. But right. you know, this is why we got cups because we got cheers. It. Mm. That's good though, right? There's no <laughs> play, bro. Oh. <laughs> uh, be feeling good, bro. Just don't spill, it, please. So you got it on YouTube? Hell Yours? no. That's why I got. That's why I got different colors. Oh no, that's crazy. Is <laughs> that good drink, oh, bro? Yeah, bro. Cause I need you gonna be loose. <laughs> you gonna be loose. Yo, what's good with y'all? Welcome back to episode two of No Regulars Podcast. I'm here with my guy Fritz. Yo, Yo. Fritz, it was good. It was good. Yo, what's going on? No Regulars Podcast. <laughs> 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 we lit. Oh, we lit, huh? You about to be lit, man. You about to be swerving. <laughs> nah, nah, nah. It better not be nothing in that bitch. There's this drug me. That's crazy. But anyways. It's tough. You know why I brought you on this show? What's up? Why? Because you, cause you one of my friends that I know for a long ass time. Yeah, like like eight plus years, maybe? It might be ten. Ten years? It might be going on ten. ten. Nah. Because I know you what? Sixth six grade. Yeah. And we was like, what? Ten, well, how old can you get? Six, yeah, ten years, eleven years old, right? Twelve, around there, yeah, ten years around there. That's crazy. And it's like it's like everything just flew by. Exactly. Flew by. See, really you remember? I remember one story we had. Like this is the <laughs> one memory I have of Los you. Los Angeles or something. Like now, nah, well, yeah, Las Vegas. Las Vegas. You remember that, right? Mm -hmm. So look, this is what happened, right? So, I'm going on a trip to Las Vegas. This is sixth grade. And me and Fritz had lockers right next to each other. This nigga Fritz come up next to me and was like, Oh, Darren, she about to go to Vegas? Yo, give me a girl number. <laughs> I was like, Bet, I got you. I, I got, got you. you. He, and he didn't come with no number. You tell me what your excuse was. I forgot what you told me what your excuse was. I think you told me that you were going to get one. See, I got the girl's name, age. Mm -hmm. He got <laughs> everything but the number. But how? the number. Oh. How? how does that even make how? Nah, I remember that too, but I don't think that's the first time I talked to you. I don't think so either. I don't remember the first time I talked to you. I don't I don't even remember the first time like how we like actually like introduced ourselves or I know we had um Homeroom. Homeroom because yeah, our last names with W and stuff like that. But you don't remember. I'm I seen you um you don't remember that. I seen you fifth grade. You stalking me now? Nah, <laughs> talk not, about not even like that. Um, Cranford Pool, you remember that? Yeah. Uh, we was I seen Javon, I seen you. I you seen was there that day. Oh, Cranford I think Poole. I might remember Cranford Pool, and you was playing basketball. You weird. How you remember? Yo, I, I don't know. That's really all I remember. Because it's crazy because I just now thought about it, and I was like, yo, I knew Darren's for a while. Well, I didn't really talk to you. Like, I just remember some fat kid playing basketball. I was cooking, though, right? Nah, I nah. don't think so. I, I ain't see you, I ain't see you like, dribble or nothing. You were just shooting. And you had your little swimsuit on, I think. <laughs> hey, nigga pause, was pause, checking pause. me out. <laughs> I just remember that little kid, you know, shooting the basketball. That's really it. There was another time. Remember the Washington um Fair? Fair. And we was playing football. Mm -hmm. I remember that day, too. Mm -hmm. You didn't go to Washington. It's, I didn't go to Washington, but I think you what told me you to go to the fair. Somebody told me. It was I'm either I, you or somebody else. I don't know if it was me, but... Excuse me. I don't know if it was me, but I do remember uh, you playing back, um, football at the Washington fair. Yo, that it shit was lit. Bro, it was lit. that was contact football. We was going up against, like, yeah. high school kids. So, nigga, like, I'm threw me, bro. Oh, word. I don't remember... Yo, I think I was cooking that day, bro. I'm not even going to lie. I used to go crazy at football. Every day. <laughs> Every day. Your first try to say, like, he all-state football. I, I, I could have went all-state <laughs> football, honestly. I could have went D1. I had the hands. D1? Yeah. <laughs> Yo. Oh, I ain't talking about shit. 
There's, I had the hands, bro. Yeah, that, was com- that was that was so awkward. That bro. was very weird. Was so <laughs> Yo, weird the- why Yo. didn't you grab my hand, my? <laughs> Yo, cause you know why? Cause me and Jay have a handshake, and like we do it all the time. So what I'm doing, <laughs> bro? I'm literally grabbing. This. He, he didn't grab my hand. <laughs> Yo, like, that was Max. That was that, that, that was Max. <laughs> I'm not even talk oh, about that. Shit. Yo, nah, but yeah, I used to play football at Washington School all the time. Yo, everybody, this is backyard football. Fritz ain't never put no fat pads on. No, but I was all, too scared. I understand. I was too scared. It was it was scary yeah, time. Was like when I first played basketball, like I was too, I was mad scared. Mm-hmm. It's like, like that's really what it is. And I was like, I cried. Scared. You pussy. <laughs> oh, I nah, cried, bro. Nah, I cr- crying bro, you... is crazy. <laughs> <laughs> crying is crazy. Wait, dude. what? Nah, crying is crazy. How old were you? I was like eight. Crying is crazy. Son, you never you never cried the first day of school? When I was like in like, when I used to go to Irvington. Yeah, what was that, fourth grade? I was in fourth grade. I, I was like fourth, third grade, but I cried. Nigga, in first grade of school, I went to in third grade. Third grade, that's when I came to Union. Did you cry? <clears throat> no. I cried. You pussy. I cried. <laughs> you pussy. Nigga, I was yeah. one of them kids, bro. Yeah, but I just, I just, I was just really too afraid. Like, I guess you could call it stage fright, but it's just, I couldn't do it. Like, because it's like, damn, what if I do ass? You know? You was thinking like that when you was a kid, bro? Yeah. That's tough. But I wasn't really, like, old, like, young, young. I was probably, like, maybe 11, 12. Like, what if I do bad in front of these people? I mean, that's just how, the, that's just how it is. Exactly. I was just afraid. I was like, I don't know what the fuck these niggas. Like, I played baseball, and, like, I didn't like baseball anymore because I was getting bored. And then my dad was like, I'll put you in basketball. I was like, nah, I don't want to do that shit. And they just did it anyways. I was hella scared. You didn't want to play basketball? Nope. I never. I didn't want to play. And then my dad was like, nah, you play basketball. And they just put me in. Oh, that's crazy. I know, right? That's that's a turn of events. That's, nah, it is a turn of events. That's like, hilarious. Imagine there's not playing basketball. Like, Nigga, I'll probably there. still be fat. Fat as fuck. Nah, I need to put a picture that up that of that how I was fat. Like that shit, that shit got go like right here. That nigga there is was chubby. Fritz was one of those was those kids that used to try hard in gym class. Mm-hmm. Nigga, Fritz used to run a mile in like six minutes at I, in I, like sixth grade. Bro, I really used to try hard at gym class because I actually really liked gym class. Like I, even physicals, like when we used to have uh, what was those fitness days? Fitness days, yeah. Even yeah, I fitness hated days. That shit. Like, I used to like that shit. Like, oh, we we running around Kwame Park? That's lit. Like, like I'm going crazy. Fitness days, I really like fitness days. Like, it was like, it, it wasn't a problem with me. Nah, I like, I like Kwame. Yo, remember, remember the inside jokes you used to have? Nah, I don't remember. Bro, that. you're lying. I know you're, rem- you don't remember who what, bro? <laughs> who what? Nah. You yeah. Fritz, don't lie, bro. I really don't. Fritz. Oh, who what? That sounds familiar, but I don't. I Fritz, don't you don't remember Sigs, bro? Sigs was Paulie. Sigs yes. was Paulie. ACDC was uh, Matthew. Matt. <laughs> Yo, you remember what mine was, bro? Jamie. What? Huh? <laughs> you think, what the fuck? <laughs> nah. What was yours? Remember, they used to call me fucking. Um, um, um. <laughs> Lee, some Lee, Lee, Lee. What was it? It was, it was Asian Sue Young, shit. bro. Sue Young, bro. Sue Young. Was Niggas Sue Young. was getting bored of calling me Jackie Chan because I'm half Asian. They start calling me Sue Young. That little girl from Rush Hour. Yeah, yeah. What that type little, of shit is that? that type girl. of creativity, my nigga. That's crazy because uh, I never really called you that. I wasn't really with the inside. I don't know what I had. I'm pretty sure I had. They one. probably some had some Haitian shit. I don't it was know. Really, it was probably some Haitian. Yo. These kids, when they were when around Kwame, like Kwame, Haitian jokes was it was not funny, bro. <laughs> y'all, y'all used to make me. It not wasn't that be bad, Haitian, bro. To be like, yo, I don't really like me being Haitian no more, bro. I really hated that. I know you laughing. I'm dead ass. <laughs> <laughs> like, yo, it wasn't even that bad in middle school, <laughs> bro. Okay, when it came to high school, it was bad. You know why? What? It was because of Benji and Collins. Them niggas were saying like the that was one the Haitian joke. Like niggas was wilding with that shit. They were saying like Haiti is like some place where there's only straight voodoo and dirt and mud yeah, pies. I was like, that's, that bro, was that, that used to blow. Yo, that was Zaki. Zaki said something one time. I showed him a picture of Haiti, bro. And he was like, 
It looked like it looked like a bunch of cardboard boxes <laughs> stacked on top of each other. <laughs> and I was like, nah, that is funny, bro. I'm crying. He said it looked like nah. The funny is, shit. The nigga said that there was flying ostriches in Haiti, bro. Yeah, and talking trees. <laughs> like, nigga, even I used to believe that shit sometimes. I used to be like, wait, is it? Yo, I never asked my parents, but nigga said no, there was. But flying. voodoo. I'm pretty sure voodoo was probably. Like, oh yeah, bro. But. Yo. Who is was real, my nigga? Talking trees is crazy. I feel like you guys was just making shit up and just <laughs> trying to, like... Why Haiti, though? Because there was so many of y'all. Union is just full of Haitian people, so it was just... I understand. It was just only right. I understand. So it's a good and bad thing. I understand. When you grow up with one, like, what, with a family of Haitians, bro, it's like... It's like, yo, these niggas is annoying, bro. I mean, I feel like that's with every family, though. Haitians is different. Nigga, bro. Haitians going them ha- Haitian niggas about to like, cancel not, you. Like, I, okay, let me say this: It's not like I don't like them. It's like, bro, they get like Haitian parents are very annoying people. Like, especially <laughs> mine. I, I can't speak for every other Haitian parent in the world, but mine, bro. Them niggas get annoying, bro. Aren't and they strict? Very strict. Mine, very. But it's like. I grew up with, you know why you guys would, like, not even want me to go outside, or, like, wouldn't even ask me to go outside or whatever, because, because of them niggas. What, they didn't let you go outside? Dead ass. I mean. I don't know, but it's probably, you know, they're immigrants and shit like that, so they don't know, like, it's probably past experiences or whatever. I mean, yeah, like, that's how, like, African parents usually be sometimes. Yeah, I get it, but, yeah, they used to get, they used to know the hell out of me. That's tough. But yeah, we had hella inside jokes back to inside jokes. We had hella inside jokes, bro. Son, it got so bad that remember the principal called all the boys into the auditorium and was like, cut this shit out. Yeah, yeah, I remember. Because they were starting to catch up on that shit. Yeah, I was looking at Matt the whole time because um, when I would, I already knew Matt's um, ACDC and um, he had some, he had a he had multiple. Yo, he had hold on. And let, and let me explain to them like what the inside joke was. So the joke was like, there was a certain word that you couldn't say. And, like, if you said that word in front of that person that it corresponds to, that nigga would turn around and look at you. And, like, everybody that. knows about it. So they're like, oh, you're... W-. It was like a curse. Mm-hmm. Like a curse word. What was who what, though? That was Matt. That like, was who what is because he used to stutter, I think. Like, he's be like, who what? Like, wow. he's doing Matt. Like, <laughs> niggas used to make that shit awful weird. Like, what the fuck? Nah, that's fucked up. Like, remember, they used to call it Ish Zero because he looked like I, I nigga remember, remember Holes. I remember Zero. And then that nigga... What's his name? Bus. He got his hair, head stuck in a chair. I remember mine, bro. What was it? <laughs> no. Mine is fucked up, bro. Motherfuckers used to call me Paul. You remember Paul? Oh. <laughs> Paul the fucking alien, bro. <laughs> wait. Wait, the alien from where? From the movie, Paul. <laughs> Search him up. You are, you are. Wait. Wait, oh shit. Search him up, bro. Yo, I forgot about that shit. I, I remember that. Paul, hold on. Yo. <laughs> Niggas used to look... Yo. Where is he at, bro? What movie was that from? Paul, the movie. Literally. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yo. I was like that nigga. Nah, they did you dirty, bro. They did me dirty, bro. Mine, like, but mine was, like, low-key. Yeah. You know who, you know who... Like, we um, wasn't, we wasn't, like, the big... Name shit. Yeah, like, yeah, it wasn't like, yeah. You know who gave it to me? I don't who? know. Um, Isabella Xavier. She she flamed my ass, bro. She said you look like Paul, bro. <sighs> shit, that's tough. Hey man, that's whatever, man. I, bro, uh, like when I tell y'all, like these jokes was really bad. Ruthless. Like, like the kids that you would say the joke to will like will be so sad, like about to kill themselves. Mm-hmm. I think I think Matt used to cry. Like, oh yeah, to, he did. He, he cried because yeah. he had like what, like ten of them shits. He had. Hella jokes. It was like who, what, ACDC. ACDC. He had some other shit. It was, it was, it was a lot. And it was to a point it. where they were just making shit up because they knew it was going to bother him. Mm-hmm. Like, it was his fault, honestly. It was his fault because of his reaction. Like, his reaction about it, like, would be so funny. So, I remember Frank used to go jump on that. This shit was like a meal or some that. shit. He said, what? Wasn't Frank's like a meal, the rat from Ratatouille? I thought it was, um... Yes. Or it was like rat. It yes. was some shit. Niggas used to yes, call him a rat. Yes, it was. Like, niggas was... Yo, kids yes, was, was bad, bro. Yes, it was. Kids was bad. Like, we really just be flaming each other for no reason. Hell yeah. But... That's, that's tough. Whatever. It was fun days, though. Like, it was good days, but... 
But look, I also have another thing I want to tell you about. Because me and you both had experience of some crazy shit, like, recently. I don't know if you remember. You definitely, you definitely do remember. What? Remember when we was coming back from Jordan's birthday party, like, two months ago? Where? Wait, when were you? Yes, when we see... I, want me to explain or you want to explain it? Uh, I'll explain it. All right, go ahead. So, we were... Wh- where were we at? Jo- Jordan... We Jordan? was at Jordan's birthday party in Outback. And we was yeah, coming Jordan, home. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We was coming home. Darius is driving and shit. We taking a... We taking an exit. An exit. So, we see... So it was a I dark ass street. A dark ass street. Like, I don't know. So, I see this... This uh, I guess this lady, bro. I don't know how. how it looked like a little. Think? It would look like a little girl from like the fifties. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like exactly. Wearing fifty where, clothes. Where she was wearing. Yeah, it was like her dress would look like mad raggedy. So I'm just like, so I see this girl. Like, yo, there's yo. You see that girl? And there's like, yeah. I'm like, yo, stop, 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 stop. stop. So I was like, yo. I look at there's. I was like, there's like you. Should I say some shit? Like I said, go ahead. And I was like, yo, this lady, bro, turned back fast as hell, bro. That shit was scary. Started so. walking towards us. And I was like, yo, Darius, go, go. This nigga Darius was taking mad long to go. Because I wanted to see, my nigga. I was interested. You wanted to see, bro? Yo, I was like, yo, Darius, go, go, go. This nigga said, mm. and I'm like, yo, drive faster. <laughs> put, the, put, your, put the gas, like... Cause Ooh. like I was like yo I don't want to see you I now that I look back at it I I want to I regret kind of telling you to go because I wanted to see how she looked low like key. I just wanted to cause like we weren't trying to hit on it we just cause it looked mad like sketchy cause yeah. she it's She's a walking it's like what twelve o'clock twelve thirty at night yep and the girl looked like she was like fifteen I think she was walking barefoot too like low key I, I she looked like that. like on God she looked like she was just came out of like a time shit like she mm. looked. Like very like mm-hmm. from like nineteen thirties and shit. Mm-hmm. And then when somebody yells your name late at night, you don't just turn, don't around, just and, turn around and walk to the car. Yeah, bro. And like yeah. I didn't even like I didn't see no face. And like it was just mad dark. I just dipped. That was mad scary. No, it was so scary. I, I, I regret telling you to go. Because... So do you think that was a ghost? Cause Union is low key <laughs> haunted, bro. Hell no, that was no ghost, bro. Do you believe in ghosts? Yeah. You do. No, I don't think we could see them though. We oh, can't see them. I feel like certain ones you can. I think. What do you think? <laughs> oh <laughs> shit! Like, I low key think she was a prostitute. What? <laughs> Yo, what? What? I think she was a prostitute. Friends, that girl was like fourteen. No, she wasn't, bro. She looked like she, a little ass girl. No, she didn't, bro. She Did looked, she? To me, nah. she did. I mean, from my nah, angle, she looked like she was at you, least twenty something, bro. That's Max. Man. I feel like she. I, I don't think she was no ghost, but I think. I she, think it was a ghost. Or maybe I think she was like a. I think she was a homeless person. Either a homeless ain't person, no maybe. Ain't no way. How was she not a homeless bro. person? I think she was a homeless person that like you know she's, you know, I don't know, bro. She was. I didn't see her face, but. I think she was a homeless person. I don't know, bro. Just walking. Yeah, that she, she on crack. Barefoot. Yeah, exactly. I thought she. I think she was off. Off some shit. I don't know. But she was scary, bro. Bro, like, but do you think Union's haunted, though, after all the shit that happened in Union? Because, you know, I like, know all, that. all the revolution, remember all the revolutionary shit they used to tell us in history class, like, happened in Union? Hell no, I didn't pay attention to that shit. <laughs> but yeah. let, me, let me tell you a couple of ghost stories I have in my family. What? All right, so, you want stuff that happened here, or you want stuff that happened, I'm going to tell you what my mom told here? me. I'll tell you that after. Nah. <laughs> look, look, look. So... I got a ghost story. My aunt was babysitting my cousin, and my aunt's like in her. She was like a teenager, and the my cousin, or it's her cousin, and she mm-hmm. was like two or three, right? Mm-hmm. So she goes into this room, and like nobody goes in that room. It's nobody's room, and she goes, "Hey, Chris," and then she's like, "Who are you talking to?" She's like, "My friend Chris," and she thinks like it's imaginary friend, right? Okay. And then so they they're redoing the room. And then you take the wallpapers down, and it says, Chris was here on the wall. Yeah. <laughs> nah. Yo, Wait, you seen that? I didn't see it, but, like, that's what happened. That's what happened with your mom, you said? Like, my aunt. And then there was another... She had another story where... um, What's it called? 
So, you know, record players, right? Yeah. So, the record player was on top of, like, a big, like, thing. So, like, there was a little girl, so they couldn't reach it. Mm -hmm. And, you know, to change the song, you got to flip the record player over. So, like, they're playing the same song. I think they was playing Michael Jackson or something like that. And then the song flips. By itself. By itself. Like, nobody touches this shit. And they're like, did you change the song? It was like, we can't reach that. So, it's like, what the fuck happened? Okay. Want me to tell you what happened in this house, though? What happened in this house? See, I believe in ghosts. Like, I feel like... I do, too. Like, I, I feel like ghosts is, like, there's, like, there's demons and then there's ghosts. But I feel like ghosts be walking around us all the time. Like, you yeah, ever just yeah, yeah. Like, feel like somebody's looking at you? No. Well, yeah. Uh, looking at me? Yes. But I don't think they're ghosts, bro. Like, I I don't think you could feel. I don't think you could feel ghosts. I know they're probably, like, walking around. You know, Miss, um, do you remember Miss, what was her name, bro? From what? From high school. Um, she was some little short English teacher, long hair, glasses. What grade? Do you remember? A junior. She, I had her my junior year. Did it start with the M? Miss Morelli. Morelli, probably. Something like That's that. That's probably her name. I don't yeah. Know. Um. So she named her ghost uh, Ron or some shit like that. Ron. She, yeah. Seriously, I'm dead ass. Like she named her ghost, and bullshit was happening in that class. Like the the um. The blinders would fall down, uh, uh, like fall down the window. The window would close. It would shut by itself. Are you serious? I'm dead ass. And she, she would just be. Oh, that's just Ron. What the fuck are you talking about? That's Yo, Ron, what? Bitch. Bitch, what? Yo, are you Ron was wilding. Ron used to be wilding, my boy. <laughs> Yo, yeah. that really happened? Yeah, swear to God. What the it, fuck? It happened before my, in one of my, my classes. Like when the blind just fell down. Yes. That's max. By by yourself. So I do believe in ghosts, I do, but I don't believe that. I believe that there's demons, and ghosts too, yeah. some different shit. But I don't believe like you'll be able to like touch a ghost or like feel a ghost or like hear one. I don't think so. Nah, I mean or see one. I don't think so. I, I think you. Think so. All right, so let me let me tell you about my experience. Right, so this is when we first moved into this house. So I'm like seven. Seven, seven, oh, six. Shit. Yeah. So, my sister was like one. Mm-hmm. So, me and my mom. I think it was like me and my mom and my sister in the house, and like we couldn't find her bottle, and like they found it in the basement. It was in the basement. Yeah. Like I, I don't go what's down your, there. Your dad. My dad wasn't in the house. Whoa. Okay. <laughs> so uh, like, where was your mom at? With you? My mom was holding my sister, and okay. like I don't, I, I don't go in the basement. I didn't even know where the basement was. We just moved in. Like, and then there was another time I used to run run through the hallways right here, mm. and my mom used to yell at me. So one day, like, she heard somebody running the hall. She's like, Darius. No, it, I, like, she was like, Darius, stop running. And I'm standing right next to her. I was like, I'm right here. Oh. And she was like, and then, like, we have, like, a little, we have a little troll in the house. So do you think it's still here? Yeah. Have you ever heard it, like, recently? I mean, not really. Not really. It's I mean, like, there was one time I thought, Somebody like, cause you see the, you know this mirror right here, right? Yeah. And like, I could see the door, and my door. I used to see my door open. I thought I seen somebody walk past it. One day, but like, I think I was just tripping. Yeah, you're probably just tripping. Like, I feel like ghosts, like, are just spirits that just can't go back to the, like, go to heaven or some shit. They're just like trapped here. Either cause something happened, or it's like something they did, or they yeah, just probably. Oh, yeah, that, and they're just trying to find a way back. But demons is another thing. I don't. I yeah, don't demons think I don't is, got no is demon different. Though. I'm like some Ouija board type shit. No, hell Wait, no. Wait, do you think you could like? Yeah, so you think Ouija board? Have you ever did a Ouija board? Hell before? no, I ain't you never do that shit. Damn. Remember when we went uh, Rando Naughty? Yo, <laughs> I was about to start talking about that shit too. Yo, oh, nigga, you were wow. scared as hell that day. Yes. <laughs> First of all, why are we doing it? First of all, hold on. Let's get this out the fact that you guys hold me. Wow. Me wearing a white shirt <laughs> while everyone's wearing... Or you... Wait, what color? Yeah, I was wearing white. We was all white, wearing black. <laughs> and y'all wearing black and, nigga, I'm... I'm I look like, that, a, a like a ghost. Yeah, like I'm the one that... I could... Come on, bro. That, that used to... That, you all hold my shit, bro. I was mad. <laughs> I was like... I was like, hold on. I see Jay in the, over there. I'm like, hold on. Why? Do, why? No one's wearing white. Like, 
niggas just a hoe. Niggas hold me, bro. He was like, there, Jordan was like, oh, we're gonna act like ghosts, act like ghosts. <laughs> and I'm like, I bet, say less. Cause it was no like that. White. Cause we all, it just happened, and was like, yo, watch Fritz wear black. And was like, nah, let's make him wear white. I had a black <laughs> shirt and I took it off. I'm like, I'm like, all right, let me, let me put on my white shirt, nigga. We gonna be ghosts. Nah, y'all hold me. Bro. That was so funny, bro. But we went rand- rando nodding. And oh, let me explain what rando nodding yeah, is first. Explain what we're so rando nodding is an app where like you manifest something, like you click it and you manifest something. So say we manifest like the color green and like it gives us a coordinate and like when we go there you're gonna see something green mm-hmm. what we was trying to do we, we did green the first time right yeah we seen that we seen um, a lady, lady wearing green, green and she was walking towards us scary. and we dipped yeah um that was scary but I remember when we tried manifesting some uh crazy shit like what was ghosts it? ghosts or something like that but it didn't work it just brought us to some creepy ass place yeah some creepy ass place like the woods man. yeah the woods and um Cranford. Yeah. Yeah, but that shit really didn't work like that. I mean it worked with the person with the wearing green and shit like that, but I feel like we gotta do it again though. We did the um we tried manifesting some red, I think. Yeah. Did something and happen? I think uh was we it were a car? in front of a red door. I don't oh know yeah, yeah. House. It was some shit. Some like I think that. we we should try it again. No, though. what we tried to manifest in was money. We didn't get and we didn't get money. We got the color the green. Went, yeah, wearing the color green. What if that lady was gonna give us money? I don't want. I don't want to find out. We did. She, she, she looked did. creepy. Yeah, she was walking. We was walking, and, and you guys was like, "Yo, look at the camera, the back camera." Yeah, you know, and I couldn't see her, so I was I was kind of scared, bro. Oh like, yeah, you did bro. say that. I didn't. I didn't see her in the camera, right? Yeah, I don't know, bro. I was scared. I was scared. I didn't want to be. We could do that again, but I don't know. Oh, yeah, we could do that again. I'm down. See, I feel like because a lot of people, when they went rando nodding, they found like dead bodies. Yo. They found they ghosts. Found dead bodies. They found like creatures some, and shit. Yeah, some. Yeah. And they found, um, I remember someone found a. It was like a place full of dolls. I don't yeah, know yeah, yeah. That. I think I seen that video. Yeah, yeah. Like a, it was just like a, a big ass like backyard full of dolls and mm-hmm, shit. Mm-hmm. That was crazy. I didn't, I, Imagine I we seen out. that shit, my nigga. My nigga, I'm out. <laughs> you not seeing me, bro. yo? That like shit. I, the only reason why I did it is because you guys were there, and nigga, I'm comfortable. You know, I was comfortable, and you know, I was gonna use one of y'all as sacrifice, nigga. You, Jordan, somewhere. sacrifice. What the fuck? If some shit happens, bro, you guys are not seeing me. Okay, I understand. But like, we gotta I'm be sacrificed. No, if <laughs> gotta be something. See, how do you think that shit works, though? That's weird. Do you think it's random coordinates? I've seen, I seen some... Yeah, it's random coordinates. coordinates. And I've seen some um, a video of this lady. Like, I guess she was a homeless lady. And she she had no eyes or something like that. And it, like, she had no like, eyes? Yeah. Oh, like I think she, I know what you're talking she about. She had black eyes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She was yeah. Just, like, talking, like, yeah. Oh, I yeah. And she was, like, it was like, a de- like, she was, like, possessed or some mm-hmm. shit? Oh, I, I do seen, remember I that. I that one. That's what made me fascinated and want to do that. Nah, yeah, we gotta do that shit again, bro. Well, that I'm shit down was... to do that again. Just don't hold me. <laughs> don't hold bro, me. if we see some crazy shit, we just all gotta run. Yeah, that shit was scary, though. When And I was like, yo, we kept going deeper in the woods. And I'm like, yo, why are we still going? Like, I guys... was trying to find some weird shit. Because we was like in the woods in like Cranford. And then we went down, we went down in the back of like Curryville and shit. The deers and shit. Yeah. I know. We was just hiking for real, bro. Exactly. We really wanted to find something. I did we didn't know. find nothing. Who was it? It was me, you, Jordan, Ish, Jay, and um, and Jeter. Jeter was there. Jeter was there too. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. We was all scrunched up in that car. Nigga, I was in the middle. <laughs> Y'all hold me. I was in the middle though. I was chilling. Hey, so, bro. It just it just had to be. It was whatever though. And yeah, I'm down to go again. Yeah. Oh, I got an, I got a theory for you. So you know how? Do you believe in like? What's that word? Reincarnation? Like yeah. when you die, you reincarnate? Yeah. So I've read that. So you know I have a birthmark, right? Mm-hmm. They say your birthmark is it's how you, you died, died in your last life. Because there was a kid that had a big birthmark on his face. And when he was like eight, he was like, oh, somebody murdered me in my past life. And then they was like, what are you talking about? They was like, I could take you to him. They took him to the guy. And he was like, he killed me. The kid's like eight or nine. And then he's like, look, I can show you where my body is. They go to like a place in the woods and they find 
they they's like my body's right here but where the tree is. This is real. Yeah, it just it happened. So they dig up, they find the body, and in the body you see somebody's face, like where the his birthmark is, is smashed in, like he got shot right there in the face. So like it matched his birthmark, the little kid's birthmark matched the body that he said that was him in his past life, because that's how he died. He got shot in the face. Okay. But how long ago was like, like he doesn't know, but like he just knows like in his past life that's how he died. So like he basically proved like that guy like killed them. And like the guy that the said guy? how old was this guy? It, he was like an old man. So he was like mad confused, like how the fuck this kid knows. So he confessed, like I did kill this guy. What? Yes. When was this? Like This was what? like in the early nineteen hundred. Where, where do you find this? I wanna find that. I, I I follow a lot of conspiracy stuff, bro. I love conspiracy things. Word? I, I, I'm I'm doing I'm I've been watching it nonstop. Like I watch Mr. Ballin. I watch like shit about murder and shit like that. That's why I'm I think I'm paranoid now. Like that shit got me paranoid. But uh yeah, I, I be, so I got a birthmark. Wow. I got a birthmark over here. Like in my nose. Yeah. Where? How do you think I died? Where? Right here. I don't know. You might have got shot in the face. Like I might have got stabbed on my face right here. But all right, let me tell you another one. You know, play how Playboy Cardi got, got the. That, yeah, that. They say he's a reincarnation of Tupac. Cause Tupac died the same day Playboy Cardi's birthday. I is. know. I seen that. You seen that shit, right? I seen that. Tupac got shot in the mouth. Come on, bro. come on, Fritz. <laughs> Don't be scaring me now. Hold it's on. a co- it's a coincidence, it's a bro. Co- exactly, it's a coincidence. I don't think he's a reincarnation of fucking Tupac, bro. How you like? You never know, bro. You never know. Nah, that's crazy, bro. I do believe in reincarnation. I believe I believe that um I was probably a girl at one point. The fuck? Why? I don't know. You just think like you be seeing guys, you be like, "Dang, you look good or some shit." Like Man, so you're bugging, <laughs> yo. Nah, like you don't know what you been, what you been, like what you think you were like in your past life. Oh nah, I think I was like a fucking, like like a dog or some shit. Like I was, like no weird a dog? shit, <laughs> a dog, bro. So a person stabbed a dog. Or was stabbed I don't dog know, bro. Like I don't know if that's how. Like I maybe I got think... hit by a car or some shit. Nah, see the thing is, I don't believe that you would be like you would be a dog. I don't think you don't think you could be animals. Then, nah, nah, I don't believe that. Like, cause you know why? Cause like I feel like I don't know. It's just weird. Like a dog is crazy. Like, cause like I be I feel like I was either a dog or some kid from the country. Cause like, I just want to be like. Like in like the countryside, I don't know why. <laughs> like that shit fascinates me, my nigga. Like dude said he wants to be in the countryside. Like, like you ever just think about like, yo, like, like imagine we lived in Kansas right now, my nigga. Nigga, what is there in Kansas? I don't fucking do know. Nothing, nigga. We would be you doing. Hell- do, you no, do. I don't want to do that shit. But like, I feel like like that's it. I don't that's know. You? <laughs> that's you. That's where you belong. <laughs> I don't know, bro. Nah, I be- bro. Nah, reincarnation is scary. Though. So you believe, right? When we die. Either what we, do you believe happens when we, we either get re- reincarnated mm-hmm. or we just keep living the same life over and over again, but different outcomes. Like, think about okay. that. that why, I, that's like why we have deja vu <laughs> and shit. Yeah. Like, nobody ever explains that shit. No, for real. Like, why, why the fuck why, do, why we, do have, we have deja vu? For like, you have a dream like two months ago and then that shit happens in real life. Like, what the fuck? Yo, on everything, I've been having deja vu mad times lately. Like, it's like, see, I believe that when you die, right, you do become reincarnated. And then, like, yeah, you probably have the memories of, like, your past life or some shit like that. But you, like, you still are that person, if you know what I mean. I don't know, bro. It's, it's mad confusing. I feel like, I don't know. I feel like for, it's like. So what I think with deja vu, what I thought it was, I thought like you know how we have like unlock ten percent of our brain. Mm-hmm. I'd be thinking like sometimes it's like it's a glitch. The, It'd be like you unlock twelve. One of the percentage of your brain. Yeah, like it goes up a little bit one time, like after you have like good sleep, and then you just see something. <laughs> There's you be thinking about this. Yo, shit. I yo I'm a weird, bro. Nah, I know. Like yo, I am weird, <laughs> bro. Like I be thinking about hella shit, cause like you know what my perspective on like the world is, bro. Okay, so look, <laughs> let me tell you about this, bro. Mm-hmm. 
So, history, right? Yeah. Do you believe everything that we learned happened no. in history? No, right? Mm-mm. So you could teach. Yo, dead ass. That's a fact. How did these niggas know? That's what I'm saying. Like, how do they know what happened? Like, documentation could go only so far. Like, you have to believe that. Like, exactly. Like, say, imagine George Washington, like, wasn't really the president, mm-hmm. but he killed the first president. But they never exactly. wrote it down. Exactly, bro. Yeah, because I be I be thinking about this like all the time. I be like, yo, how did these people know? Yo, Darius, do you think about how like curse words became curse words? That's what I all the time, bro. Like, I'm like, why are those words so bad? I don't Who know. Made them that bad. It's just like word of mouth. Yeah, like like, like we li- like you know what a cult is, right? Yeah. So you know who Jim Jones is? The rapper. Nah, there's a. I think his name is Jim something. There's a guy. His name. I think his. I think he was Jim Jones. I don't know what his name was, but he won the Nobel Prize like for or Martin Luther King Award, and the next year he was he caused the the world's biggest mass suicide ever. He had a cult of 900 people, and he had them thinking like the world was gonna end, or he had them thinking like they were like they had to follow him. Uh-huh. And like he did whatever like he wanted, like he ruled them, and like people were starting to find out, and like like some Charlie Manson shit, yeah, some shit like that, and like he like he was like their god, mm-hmm. and like I guess like they was preparing him for like a apocalypse or some like some shit like that. That's what he told them, and like so so he um when people were finding out about this, he brought them all into like a little center and gave them like a drink and killed them all. Really killed like three hundred something 300 kids, three hundred people, three hundred kids, nine hundred people in total, bro. Just like it was a, it's called um Jonestown. It was called in Jonestown, I think, or Jamestown, some shit like that. Wow. Like, like cults is like what I'm saying is, bro. Like school, whatever you put in the school system, bro. Like to learn, teach these kids is how these kids will come out. Mm-hmm. So the government could teach us whatever the fuck they want to teach us. Mm-hmm. Like I could, like imagine I had a school. I could make them kids into assassins if I wanted to. No, yeah, you can. Like, you can teach like the. That's why the youth is so valuable because you could teach kids anything and they will always believe it yeah like that's why whatever we learn in the school systems like they're not learning that shit in north korea yeah so like everybody like that's why i'd be thinking like everybody has like a different world there's one world but there's millions of worlds in that one world yeah that, nah that's just crazy because like think about it we know about all this shit like technology podcast tiktoks mm-hmm. niggas in north korea don't know about they that shit know none about it. Yeah. like they think their world is completely different than our world nah that's crazy like just think about how much control like they have over us to make us think what like we don't even know what the truth is for real I would do anything for the truth of the world my nigga yo no cap you would do anything Darius nah not pause <laughs> this nigga Darius you gang. are some wild <laughs> shit like what I'm saying is I feel like there's so many secrets that we don't know and so much stuff that happened in the past that we will never know no, I don't know. Like, think about it. Like, there could have been a great person that they just killed off and just took his whole identity. He could have been the next president. Yeah, we don't know, Um, you know, about uh, Dr. CB or something like yeah. that. Yeah. Like, didn't he, what was he? He <clears throat> made the cure. Cured to, to like, like, like cancer hella, and shit? Yeah, hella shit. Like, cancer or, like, um, HIV, shit like that. Bro, and like. And that, they killed him off. It was the government, man. Nah, I'm not even gonna talk about bro, that. Bro, like, there's so many. Me, bro. Fuck that shit. Bro, there's like so many secrets in this world, bro. Yo, there's sometimes. Do you think like people like kind of like lived the same life, low key? What do you mean? Live the not same even life? live the same life, but like be having like the reacting the same to others. Because I be I be seeing um like YouTubers or comedians, right? And they be like, when you wake up for school early for school and shit like that and he be doing the same shit that i be doing or like or like when people um have like when you see like memes or like shit on instagram right yeah comedians be reenacting like how they feel when they do this or when they do that right Mm -hmm. i'll be seeing the same thing i'll be looking at the comments i'll be like yo this is the same thing everyone been living the same life I'd be like, I'd be feeling Oh, like, I know what you mean. Yeah, I'd be feeling like... People, like, it's like a coincidence, like everybody... Yeah, like everyone did this before. Like, you know? I, I know what you mean, because like, I think there was one thing that was going around. There was like a trend. I forgot what it was. It was like something, like 
something like I do on a daily basis mm-hmm. and like people are saying like, oh, that's weird. Like that's mad weird. Yeah. And like they never thought of that before. I'm like, I do this shit on a daily basis. Exactly. Exactly. I mean, I feel like some people do. I feel like a lot of people went out. Like, like live our same life, but we don't know about it. But we don't know about it. Like exact same life or similar? Not even similar. the exact same life, but we react. I don't know. Like, I guess we do the same shit. Like, like, I don't know. I mean, I feel as though like us as people, there's like different paths that we can go through. And like sometimes we're going to match up with the path that somebody else is doing. Yeah. Yeah. So like, I understand you with that. I never thought of some shit like that. That's crazy. Like, imagine somebody doing the same shit I'm doing right now, like with his friends, like a podcast. Yeah, like we're doing a podcast. That's, right some, weird shit, That's some weird shit, bro. That's some crazy. Like some nigga in like fucking shit. London. Yeah. Like in Kansas, my nigga. Nah, there's a nigga like. What me is up K- with you in Kansas? Man? I don't know, bro. Like <laughs> it's weird. Want to go to like, Kansas? Like I think so when bad. I'm like when I'm older, like I think I'm gonna move to like South Jersey or some shit like that. Why? I don't know. Like I just like open space. Like, it's just peaceful. You want to be in a farm, bro? Not a farm, but, like, buy a farm. I don't want to have my farm, bro. I just want to be, like, open area. See, now I don't even know who you are right now. <laughs> I'm going to be honest. I really don't, like, why? Do what do you know? think you're going to live when you're older? You want to live around See, here? yo, bro. Let me talk to you, bro. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> talk to you. Oh, shit. The closer I've been, like, you know, growing up, like, I'm like, yo, we're 22. Yeah. And, nigga, in three years, you might be married. Shit, I might get. get nah, I'm gonna be married in like four years, not gonna lie. Me and Jay get years. married. Four years? What? Yeah, I'm 21. Yeah, 25. Yeah. Okay. That'd be, that's a good time. I think I'll be financially, sa- financially stable by then. Okay. Um, you say you're gonna have a kid? No. I'll like, give you two years. Two years to Boy, knock on wood, bro. You don't wish that shit upon me. <laughs> You're bugging. When I get a kid, I'm I'm gonna be at least like maybe twenty seven. Are you gonna be married before you have a kid? Yeah. Okay. But the thing is, bro, let me talk to you, bro. I feel like the you know, we're growing up, like, you know, time goes by quick. Super as quick, hell. my nigga. So it's like, bro, I feel like I really haven't had the time to sit down and think about what your life and shit like what i'm going to do like it's not like i'm like like worried about it yeah i'm not worried about yeah because i know anything that i do i'm gonna be good at like yeah you know i'm gonna because i'm gonna put like or i'm gonna work hard at but it's like whatever god you know puts in front of me and shit like that i'm gonna have to go crazy on that shit yeah no but it's like I never sat down and thought, like, damn, what am I going to do? You See, know? I always think about that a lot. Like, yeah. what am I going to do after, like, college? Like, this is my last semester. Exactly. I'm about to graduate. Like, I don't know what I'm about to do. Exactly. Like, I don't know if I'm going to do... Like, the reason why I made this podcast is because, like, I wanted to make this to be fun. Mm-hmm. Like, something fun. Like, I don't want to be, like... Like, I don't care about, like, this blowing out this stuff. But like, if it does... Exactly. You don't then know it does. it does. But I'm going to go... As far as I can with it, like mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying? Because mm-hmm. like I want, I want all of us to look back on this like when we're older and just have like a laugh. Because these are memories that we're capturing on like film and shit. Very true, bro. Yeah, that's and like a- this is something I could do on the side too. Like, yeah, yeah. damn, it's crazy. And and a lot of people do struggle with that shit. Like, what they're gonna do? Yeah, right, because they really as as like kids or whatever, they really never had to sit figure. down and think and figure out like what what are you gonna do. And it, and it's not until college they find some shit like, oh, I'm about to do this and that. And when they do, you know, succeed in whatever major that they're in, they don't even like it. Exactly. You know, so it's like. Like, I'm in business right now. Like, like I like business. Like, I feel like I'm a business guy. I want to, like, open up, like, my own gym and shit. Mm-hmm. But, like, this shit, like. Like, they teach me some shit like I can learn on my own. Like, niggas, common sense. They teach me how to be a leader. Like, I know how to be a fucking leader. What the fuck? Like, like it's the same exact class all over and over again. I'm like, what the fuck? Exactly, bro. So Yo, kids, cool. low-key college is a scam. I'm not even going to lie to college you. College is a big scam. Like, especially nowadays, bro. You can make money off of anything. Anything. But you just got to be... You got to find you a way. Find. It's, it's, it's really finding a way of how, like, how you going to make money. And... You know, I, me, I want to have, like, multiple streams of income. income facts. So, 
you know, me, I'm, I'm, I'm I told you you should stream, bro. Hell yeah, I'm not worried about like, I'm not worried about doing just like straight one thing going crazy. I, I, I'll, I'll do streaming. I'll do streaming. I'll do clothing. I'll do makeup. I don't care, bro. Makeup. Bro, you know that uh, or skincare or some shit. Like I, I heard, lady skincare. Wait, like you're selling this stuff or you're gonna make it? Like me and my girl wanna, you know what I mean? Like do a channel of it or, or do YouTube? Wait, I'm still thinking of, like skincare, makeup. What are you talking? Where are you going with this? No, nigga. Like, come on. Are you son, gonna I'm make makeup? Sick. I don't know. <laughs> like what the fuck? <laughs> nigga, I don't know. I'm like, thinking you about know. to do makeup tutorials on, or you gonna do it on Come somebody? On, not yourself, son. not yourself, not yourself. I mean on somebody. Like you nah, know, I do makeup. Like, like, you feel me? Because no, when I say makeup, it's just cause like my girl want to do the same shit. Like, oh, I she want to do this. So, like, anything, bro. I anything. know. Like, there's there's so many ways to make money nowadays, bro. Hell yeah, so many ways to make money. So many ways, and I feel like you know, right now. Me, right now, I think I'm a little late when it comes to, you know, oh, damn, I gotta do this. I gotta, or like, I feel like I you can never be this. late, though. Everybody has their time. Yeah, that's true, because a lot of 30-year-olds or whatever, like, they just figure out, like, oh, may, oh I'll do this, and they become successful. In like, that. I feel like nowadays, like, kids want to be rich so fast. Mm-hmm. Like, you, like, it doesn't happen yeah, like that. Yeah, live your life. Live like a kid. Like, me, I think I was playing video games and shit like that. Nigga, we but, still playing video games. Oh, yeah, We 22, 21 years old playing yeah, video nigga, games. I'm not <laughs> gonna, like, I'm not going to stop. Yeah. But I'm just saying, like, I feel like I kind of regret. Not regret because everything happens for a reason, but I should have thought about it earlier. About what? Like, what the fuck I'm going to do, like. I know what you mean. You know, like maybe before college. Yeah. You know, and but I had a semester off. I had a semester off. Like, yeah. Like, actually, not even a semester, a year off. Yeah, it was a year off. And you know, I was I wasn't even in a really good place at that time. So it's like, I really maybe at that time I should have stopped and thought what I'm gonna do. Mm-hmm. And, but instead, of, instead I really threw it away and played 2K the whole time. Nigga, we was tough that year though. Two K and Fortnite, going, we was, was going, going crazy. crazy. We was going crazy. Nigga, we the best so, duo on two K. Maybe, 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 maybe I, I should have. Maybe I should have like like streamed that year. My nigga, you can still yeah. stream though. Yeah, but what if I streamed that year? You blew up. And I blew up. And now what? I'm a streamer, nigga. Hey, bro. Like you never know. It all happens. Yeah, yeah but you know. like I feel like these kids, like it's not their fault. I feel like it's social media's fault. Cause like all we see is people. Have, like kids our age having mansions, millions of dollars, but it's like they're just the lucky, lucky bunch. And like, there's kids like probably like 16, like, oh, I want to be like them. Like, when I'm 22, like, I if I don't have a house, like, my life will fail. Like, nah, bro, mm-hmm. like, take your time, bro. Yeah, like, take your time. Bro. This is nor like, like, they're the lucky ones. Mm-hmm. You just gotta find what you want to do. And like, as long as you're having fun with what you're doing, you're gonna like the money coming in. Like, just imagine making money of things you like to do. Exactly. And that's, uh, I got, like, my parents, like, they they want me to be a nurse so bad. Isn't your mom a nurse? Yeah. Oh, yeah. They want me to be a nurse so bad. And it's like, bro, I don't want to do that shit. I know what you mean. You know, like, me, I want to, like, really, like, make money with something that I really like doing. Like, I, like, have love for. Yeah, you know, I know what you like, mean. Like, because I don't want, then you're going to be just, like, a miserable person miserable person like i don't want to be miserable my whole life that's ass i know and like come on bro like i'd rather make like 60k 70k doing something i like to do than like making maybe uh, like 200k just going to work every day just dreading it being mad as hell like just imagine that that's not all that money's not worth it my my parent and like my my aunt's a teacher she don't like that shit really hates that shit but she has to do it. I understand. You know, but it's whatever. But she got a big ass house, and but like, come on, bro. Yeah, it's like you gotta do what's for you. Like, do something that you like to do, oh. always. Oh. Like, no matter what. Like the reason, another reason why I made this podcast is like I just wanted to be different. Like I wanted, like I was thinking about doing streaming, but I'm like, that's not. I don't want to play video games all day. Mm-hmm. And I'm like, you know, let me make and a video po- games is in a bad spot right now. Anyway, yeah, it's very, like, very bo- like bland, really bad yeah. content and shit. Yeah. But it's like, you know, I just want to do something different. And mm-hmm. I feel like this is, 
Like, it just, this just reminds me of, like, the PSN parties we have. This is basically what it is. Yo. That PSN should get critical, party, my nigga. The, the PSN parties. They would have packed your ass up, two, my nigga. Two o'clock in the morning, whatever, three o'clock in the morning, bro. We used to talk about any, anything. Me, nigga, you, random you, shit. Anything. Random shit. Like, I used to pull That's my classified. Oh, my God. Nigga, we used to be on, like, four or five hours just talking about our feelings. Like, we're a bunch of... Like, we... <laughs> like, we used to, like, 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 some soft... I used to pour my heart out, pour my problems about like what's going on in my life. Those are shit. those are sacred grounds, bro. Those are sacred grounds. Bro. PSN know about the PSN parties at yeah. four o'clock in the morning. If you don't yeah. know, you need to you tune need, in yeah, for real, in, bro. bro. PSN, not no Xbox shit. Nah, not Xbox. Xbox yeah. is booty. Xbox. Ass. I made the PSN. jump, bro. I had to. Yeah, exactly. PS PSN parties, bro. That shit. Me, shit, you, UJ, if niggas I'm recorded UJ. that shit, bro, we'd be famous. We'd be famous, bro. Shit, we was Aiden before Aiden. That's a fact. That's a fact. Aiden, you stole our shit, my nigga. But yeah, like, I got to ask you on your opinion about this shit, bro. I know you heard about this shit going around. About the Britney Renner and fucking PJ oh, Wa- Washington. Yo, that's no, Max, yeah, my nigga. Yeah, nigga. Yo, the thing is, though, <laughs> he should have seen the sign yeah. before... She was on him since Kentucky, right? Yes, like he was like eighteen, nineteen. She's he should have seen the sign. Why did he? He can't even her? see. He can't even see the kid, bro. I know. He she can't. took the money and the kid. That's Max. No, he's down bad. He's down tremendously bad, bro. And I feel bad for him, bro. It's like he got finessed, my nigga. He got finessed. Bad. I don't think it was two hundred k though. How much? I think it was. I think there was gas in it. Oh, it's probably like a hundred something, or maybe, maybe like below hundred. I don't know. Maybe like sixty k. Bro. But that's like he makes he's not even off his rookie deal yet. Yeah, I'm like yo, sh- like that's od. Like, wait, so were they married and shit? Uh, I don't think they were married. Like I heard that they were married and like when she had the baby, like they went, she went behind his back and like left him and divorced him and then called the lawyer just like yo, I want custody of my kid and I want this much money for child support. Bitch is a thought. Yo, she's like she's been wanting to get her hands on niggas like this, like like Uzi, Drake, Hell James yeah. Harden. I remember Uzi. I, remember I think Uzi. Ben Simmons or some shit like niggas yeah, was ben like Simmons. niggas wasn't fucking with that, bro. Hell they was yeah. like, "Hell no, you're wild." They seen the sign before him, but they she seen the she seen fresh meat. So hey, she got that shit. She just wanted to back. Like, how down bag do you gotta be Dude. to really finesse for a kid? That's Dude. fucked up. And I feel like she doesn't even feel bad. Like you, like she, she I feel bad for the kid. I feel bad for the kid too. I feel bad for PJ Washington too, but your mom is a big ass thought. Like just like, all right. Do you think some shit like that should be illegal? Uh, yeah, I feel like that too. Is that not extortion? That sounds like extortion. Cause like you remember, like that's max. Like that's just like taking advantage of niggas. That's very much taking advantage of. Like, like maybe not advantage. jail time, but like no, you should get uh, fucking he, first of all, sued. He should, he should have like custody custody of that child, or not even custody, but you should be able to see that child. And he should, she should be paying him some type of money. Yeah. Because it's like, you just ran off with the kid and the bag like that. Like, you're fucked up. But in some ways, I'm starting like PJ. You didn't Brittany, realize? Yeah, it's Brittany Renner. Like, he was a young guy, bro. Book. She got she that nigga. She made a book about finessing about niggas. About finessing niggas. Like, how down? Like, she must have had a rough life. Like, that's crazy. Like, yo, I that's me. Though. What? Huh? Yo. <laughs> that shit is hey. bad, bro. Fucking yo. But nah, that's, that's yo, just bad. Yo, you're wild. That's, that's, that's bad. Wait, did he? Wait. What? Did he actually like nut in that bitch? Like, like he, he probably did. For real nut in that he, bitch? Like, he had to. Voluntarily? Probably. I don't yeah, fucking know. That sucks. That nigga folded. Wasn't that nigga um, LaMelo with Tiana Trump too? I think so. Low key. That nigga's wildin', bro. That nigga was off the chain when he won Rookie of the Year, my nigga. Hell yeah. yeah but, I don't know, bro. I, I don't know. I don't know how they're going to play that shit out or, like, how shit going to, you know, unfold or whatever. Ain't no like way that. she getting all that bread, bro. You can't do that shit. Ain't no way in hell. She has to have some sympathy, my nigga. He needs to have some good lawyers, bro. Yeah. Get the Jewish get people, bro. Man. Find somebody to get your your daughter or son. What is it? The girl son. Or, son? Oh, hell no. Nah, bro. He's about to be an NBA player, too. <laughs> You're wildin'. You're wildin'. Yo, that... Nah, that's... She's gonna take the sun away and the bread? He should have never fell for that. That's the thing, though. It's like... I feel like people called it, too. Yes. 
Um, DJ Academics, I think, called it <laughs> mad long ago, bro. She was like, like, she got another one. Yes, bro. It's like, come on, bro. Like, it's, you should have seen that. Seen the signs, you bro. You seen the signs, Like, bro. how the fuck she up and leave like that, like that quick? Like, when when, when she got pe- pregnant, bro, when she got pregnant, um, I remember when she posted a photo of her pregnant. They're like, oh, yeah. Yeah, he it's over. He pr- she probably drugged them. Low key. Or got that nigga mad drunk That's one what I'm day. Saying. Voluntarily, bro. Maybe not. Maybe not. But like you never know. Some shit. She that's that's manipulating, bro. That's scary. That's manipulation, that's extortion, that's That's why that's that goes to show you need to find the right one, bro. Now you really do. And some niggas I guess when they got money they be finding like the bitches that got like um Selena Powell. You know Selena? Oh, yeah. Like the, Selena Powell. The thought, she's a big thought. Yeah, that, 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 <laughs> every rapper that there is, Selena Powell. I feel like, yo, I, I don't know why they be so driven to fuck these bitches, bro. But it's like, bro, I you don't, can get any other bitch and you choose the indri- industry thoughts. Like, it don't make no sense to me, bro. And it's like, horny and crazy, bro. Yeah, niggas is horny. You got to find the right one, my boy. You really like, do. You got to be like a shit, like a. Steph Curry or some shit. Or like LeBron. Aisha. Or LeBron. Yeah. That's where, That's how you got to live. D-Wade, like, trial and error, but it yeah, happened. Yeah, D-Wade, D-Wade not bad, too. You got Gabriel. You but they, wa- they be wilding, though. What? D-Wade be wilding, bro. What you mean? He said Gabriel Union be eating his ass. Okay. I know you heard that shit. No, I see that, but I, I, I don't... Shit, I'm, I'm with it. What? <laughs> yo! Yo! <laughs> yo! <laughs> Bro, you let, we grown, bro. I, you gonna let your girl eat your ass, bro? Yes. Wait, did she? You asked me, did she? Yet? Nah, she ain't. Yet. Okay. Nah, she wants Yo. to. Yeah. Yo, <laughs> Yo, you is a wild man. Why? How? Yo, you want to get your ass ate? Oh, here we go. I got to sit up for this shit. Oh, shit. It's like, bro, it's a different type of thing. It's not like, yo, she going inside my shit. That shit crazy. You better yo. not even try. <laughs> but eating my ass, why you, you know, doing the, <laughs> that's tough. Yo. Why are you doing the, <laughs> like, <laughs> like Yo, that. you a wild man. So, like, you're not going to ask, but if it happens, it happens. Mm-hmm. Yo, I'm not gonna stop. What's the max shit? What's the max shit? Max is actually going inside that bitch. Like you're you're bugging, but she eat my ass. I like that shit. You like that shit? Like you don't even know how that shit feel. I feel like that shit will feel good, man. Yo, remember when I told her she she said that she was able she will eat my ass. She will eat your ass. Y'all niggas. Remember when I told her she she lied to me and that hurt my feelings. Yo, y'all niggas is crazy, yo. Niggas is, bro, we're grown as hell. I understand. Bro. Yo, she eat your ass, you got to marry her. Yeah. Like, no, if, like, she go go around with that in her mind, like, she just ate your ass. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> I win the situation. Like, <laughs> you just ate my yo. ass. All right, so, Famous. what was the most, like, because I know you told me you used to sneak in your girl house, right? Yeah. So, like. Tell me a story like some crazy shit that happened, like when you like. Oh wait, <laughs> tell me that one story. When we got caught. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. When we got caught, bro. <laughs> so it was just a regular day, you know. My girl told me <laughs> come over this that, and the third. I'm like, all right, cool. You a crazy I, nigga. I, bro. I snuck in plenty of times before. It's no you ever just like jump out the window? I be telling them, bro, I'm down to do that. Because, like, jump out the window. Because, yes, because it's like, but she be like, no, first, you know, what if you break your leg or something? Nigga, like, you just, you I voluntarily like, want to do this shit? Yeah, because it's like, bro, sometimes her mom be in, be downstairs just doing, like, cleaning or doing nothing. And I be like, bro, I'm trying to go the fuck home. <laughs> you know, so, and like, I probably got work at, like, early as hell in the morning. You a or, like, horny home. nigga, bro. Man, I be horny, bro. But it's like, okay. Yeah, so, tell the story, bro. Regular this is some shit. crazy shit. Regular I forgot all about we, this. We, we having fun, this that and third, watching, listening to music. That's the shit that, listening to music. That's the thing that fucked us up. We did, and that, after that, we never listened to music like that no more. And, um, you know, we, we 
you starting to, you know, <laughs> doing the yummy, you hear? Yo. Yeah. yeah. And her mom supposedly, supposedly said that she called her before, like once. Her mom never goes to her room, like never go over upstairs. That's why. So it's like she's calling her. He don't hear shit. Got the music on. Her mom goes, starts coming upstairs. And I felt like I heard some shit too. <laughs> but I didn't mind because I thought the door was locked. We always lock the doors. The doors are always locked mm-hmm. all the time. At, like after this day, bro, we always look at the lock. Yo, make sure the doors are locked. It's the end of third. And her mom. Like. They she walked in, bro. She even knock, bro. She, she just knock. She barged in. Barged in. And just seen you shit. Yeah. Like. Just clapping her daughter. Oh, <laughs> yo. <laughs> and I'm like. And she was like. What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> yo. She thought. She thought. I was her brother. Like, I was. So she like, thought her, her kids were doing incest? <laughs> She didn't know I was in the room, bro. She didn't know I was well, in the room. Well, yo, so what the fuck? I know you were scared as hell. Bro, my heart dropped. <laughs> yeah, yeah. My heart dropped to my ass, bro. <laughs> because I had my dick out and shit. And I, I just didn't want, first of all, her mom so seeing she my see shit. So she's your piece, I bro? Th- I don't think she's seeing my piece. <laughs> I, I, um, I was in that bit. But then once she said, what are you doing? Like, I don't know. And, you know. I mean, like <laughs> I'm like, oh. <laughs> What'd you say? What was the first words that came out your mouth? I didn't say anything. <laughs> My girl was like, I'm sorry. <laughs> she said, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. And, I, and I'm telling my girl, bro, that she, my girl was laughing. And I'm like, bro, this is not funny. <laughs> like, I'm scared. She's like, Prison. she's like, say my, and like, my first name and all. She knows me and shit. She's like, Fritz, get the fuck out. <laughs> I'm like, damn. Yo, I'm like damn, that's Max. And then <laughs> I'm like, Kaya, this is not funny like, because every time, like I before I even snuck in her house ever, I was like, bro, I don't sneak in because I'm so scared that that. So that was your happen. your biggest fear actually happened. Yes, biggest fear. That's Max that actually happened, and I, and then we went downstairs. I was so scared to even like. Did you just feel like ashamed. Yes. <laughs> I was so scared to even walk past her because I thought she was like gonna hit me with something. Or something. What, her mom? Yes. Oh like, shit. Hit me. But I walked out. I'm like, damn, forgot my phone. <laughs> <laughs> walked back in. Uh Miss West, I forgot my phone. Yeah, I think it's the time to end the podcast. <laughs> <laughs> shit. <laughs> This is this is a perfect time to end the podcast. Wow. This is how we end the show. <laughs> this is when we end the show. Yo, Fritz, it was good to have you, my brother. Good you already know, Thank man. Thank you for having me. Of That's course, my, bro. My hands are sweaty. My fault. Yeah, you was hella nervous in the beginning. What's up, bro? Uh, we got to have you a couple more episodes, though. But this is episode two, No Regulars Podcast. <laughs> you want to do that so bad, <laughs> you? But nah. So... Thank y'all. I hope y'all enjoyed the show. We're going to be back at it again every week. Hopefully Friday. And follow us on our socials. Probably going to be linking the bio below on YouTube, Spotify, Apple Podcasts, tune Anchor. In. Tune, tune in all that. TikTok coming soon on Instagram at noregulars.podcast. Shoot, Twitter about to be up soon. So, you yes, know, sir. only way is up now. Yes, sir. Up from here. You know what I'm saying? All right. Gangster. <laughs> I'm gonna run and go get it. I'm gonna run and go 